Whether it's from a car crash, a fall, or a sports injury, chronic neck pain can be debilitating. And if you are one of the millions who suffer, you know the traditional treatment of rest, medication, and manipulation doesn't always do the trick. Now there's a new method. Once again, here's Rod Starnes with a look at how therapists are trying to make your neck pain a thing of the past by having you spend a little time on the cutting edge. After three years, Danny Massengill is still feeling the pain of a neck injury sustained while helping a friend work on his house. It's, a, it's a, like a concrete block around your neck. It's always there. You can, you can go and you can do with it, but it's, uh, it's, it drags you down. Traditional therapy brought temporary relief, but no long-term solution. Sleepless nights and limited recreation have this avid outdoorsman trying to reel in a permanent fix. And he may have just found it. What you're looking at is the multi-cervical unit, or MCU, the future of chronic neck pain rehabilitation. This technology addresses people suffering from chronic neck pain. In the past, um, people with chronic neck pain classically have uh, clear x-rays and MRIs because the problem is probably a soft tissue issue. So we've got this dilemma. The patient has clear scans. The physician's not sure exactly what's going on, uh, being a soft tissue trauma. If the underlying problem is weakness, this technology allows us to define that weakness. Donardis, who helped develop the MCU technology, notes that weakness can even come about from everyday living. Time spent on the computer, poor posture, both can lead to neck muscle weakness and eventually chronic neck pain. The MCU targets the source of the problem. The multi-cervical unit allows us to objectively document range of motion. More importantly, it allows us to objectively document the strength of the muscles that control the neck. So the evaluation, which takes about 60 to 90 minutes to perform, has the patient performing isometric tests in 16 different positions. I'm going to have you ro rotate your head to the left as far as you can comfortably. Start test now. The readings gathered by the MCU are then compared to normal strength ranges. That's the red line on the readout. As you can see, Danny's neck strength is slightly below normal in some areas, significantly low in others. From there, we can design a specific rehabilitation program for this patient, targeting the muscles of the neck that have been found to be weak. Targeted therapy can begin in just two days, with patients seeing results after only nine treatments on average. When I first saw this technology, I said something that has stayed true. It is the missing link in neck rehabilitation. It puts the life back in the patient. We're giving them now not just short-term relief, but we're actually fixing the underlying problem. We're going to set you up on a program to help strengthen and target those muscles to hopefully improve your overall function. Sounds great. Great. For Smart Medicine, I'm Rod Starnes.